warning remains in effect for Guam. Let's go to civil defense where Governor Eddie Calvo is delivering a statement to the people of Guam. ...of this event. We are providing information to the public as quickly as we can through interviews, releases, and social media. The tsunami warning was extended to 11 p.m. by subject matter experts from federal agencies. We don't want anyone in low-lying areas until the all clear has been given. Travel throughout the island should be avoided unless absolutely necessary. No other vehicles will be allowed and police will be enforcing these restrictions. I apologize for any inconvenience. We just want to make sure that you and your families are safe. I'm sure every one of you has been watching CNN or Fox News. These are unprecedented events that are occurring in Japan. The decision that I'm making, I have to make because we have to be safe and we have, we can't take chances. We cannot take chances. Please listen to the radio or watch the news for the latest information. And please stay safe. Thank you, good evening, and God bless. Again, that was Governor Eddie Calvo from Civil Defense, the tsunami warning for Guam has been extended to 11 o'clock tonight. Everyone is encouraged to stay off of the island's road. Stay safe. Uh, if you're living in low-lying areas, seek higher ground. Uh, you can find your designated evacuation sites on KUAM.com. Again, the tsunami warning for Guam in place until 11 o'clock tonight. Stick with KUAM, Guam's news leader. Uh, we now return to your regularly scheduled program.